Uh, hey, tell us about your journey. You, you've had a fascinating last year or two. W what's going on with your college recruitment? So, you know, really it was just a lot went on going on with um, just school. So I had to grow up, really. I learned from mistakes, went over to Connecticut. It changed me as a person. So really it just made me more mature and look at things totally different. So really it just, I'd look at it as just helping me out for the future. And you were committed to Michigan State a year ago. Has the last year or so changed the things perhaps you're looking for in a coaching staff, in a program, in a school? Uh, not really. You know, Michigan State set a good example for what I was looking for. It was just the way that everything worked out. So being committed to them for a little while kind of opened my eyes out and showed me what to look for in programs. He mentioned maturing, growing. How have you seen that? Because he had to leave the nest. Yes, and with him doing so, he's right. He has matured a whole lot. Um, we're talking to my family. They're like, he, he's a different person. Like, he's grown. He's different. I'm like, yeah, but it's for the better. So yeah. I'm happy about it. How hard was this decision coming to this, this last few days? It was real hard. Like, I decided uh, last night. So it took all the way down to the wire. Really? It was last night was when you made your, your final decision. Okay. Well, should we... Uh, yeah, cut, Mike, let's get to it. I mean... with a knife here. <laughs> Stage is yours. Go ahead. Make your announcement. Where are you going uh, to play college ball? So for the next four to five years, I will be attending the University of Nebraska. Wow. <laughs> All right. Damn, All right. right. Let's go. Yeah. Well done. Congratulations to you. What made you feel like you need to be a Husker? You know, just being around them and coming down on a, a midweek visit, going down Wednesday, it was just real eye-opening. I went down on Wednesday, you know, kids doing finals. It's not like they sold me with anything or tried to, like, try to buy me over. They showed me the school. They showed me what, how they used me. They showed the academic side, which I was very impressed on. Um, just really feel like it would be a good thing for me and my family in the future. When you talked about how they would utilize your skills, what did they, you watch film, but where, where do they want to put you? Really, they say they, you know, I'm a really all-purpose back. So from running back, inside receiver, outside receiver. If I'm not a running back, I'm at receiver. If I'm not a receiver, I'm at running back. And that's the things that I like to do. And of course, special teams. And some Wildcat quarterbacks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 And uh, you're going to be enrolling in next January. semester, right? So when, do you, when are you moving up to Nebraska and getting settled in? I believe it's January 10th, I believe. Oh. That's going to be all right. You know what? It's nothing against the other schools that you, you didn't choose. But I, I can tell you this because I, I know that program and what they do academically for the young people. It, they have a great support staff. And mom and family, you guys are going to be excited on what they're going to be able to do for this young man as far as developing him academically, which is huge. They'll take football is going to take care of itself, mm -hmm. but right. you're going to see just how much you're going to grow. Mm -hmm. And you mentioned that. Mm -hmm. And I like the fact you said next four to five years. Mm -hmm. You're not trying to jump anywhere. You want to make sure you use them like they use you. Right. Mm -hmm. And mom, give us an idea. How important is it to have a son going to get a college education for your family? It's very important. Actually, actually at this level, it's, you know, outstanding and for it to be free. So that's right. <laughs> you can, what can you ask better? That's so great. I'm very proud of him. You excited? And I'm excited for what's in the future for him. So. Have you been to a Nebraska home game? Because no. those are pretty special. Oh, I hear. Those I are can't Wait. <laughs> I can't wait. I hear their fan base is off the chain, so and we've saw so far it is. Yeah, wait till he looks at his Twitter fade and Instagram <laughs> feed. You're going to see how crazy they are out there. They love their corn huskers there. Yes. Uh, anybody here disappointed with that decision? No. <laughs> Good, because uh, you, you didn't have much of a say, even if you were. 